hello guys welcome back to my channel african lioness tv here if you are new in this channel welcome if you are a returning subscriber thank you for tuning in thank you for always coming to watch my video yeah today we are going to uh, learn how to preserve our yam our cuckoo yam save it on our freezer for future use so there are so many ways you can preserve your stuff and uh, you know it will ease you stress you know uh, um, uh, from every day doing the same thing so if you just do it once you preserve it put them in your ziplock and all that so we are going to watch how to do all this right now on this channel uh, yeah so that will make it easier for us in our future use so stick to the channel continue watching but if you are new in the channel i really appreciate welcome but click the red button to subscribe to the channel hit the red uh, hit the bell notification icon so that whenever we upload a new video you will be the first person to get the video okay like and share the video make it go viral so that others can learn too yes thank you for return for my returning subscribers thank you for always coming to watch my video yes thank you so much i appreciate your love and support so we are really growing i know i thank god for all that so thank you so much keep watching subscribe to the channel if you are yet to subscribe hit the red button to subscribe to the channel okay yes like and share the video like i said before share the video make it go viral for others to share from our thoughts okay don't forget to put your comment down on the comment section that is where we share our thought okay yes uh, i would appreciate so much to read through your comments through the comment uh, section so keep watching guys keep watching okay yes so let's go guys let's go yes Today's video, I'm going to show you guys how you can preserve your yam. You know, G, you know, yam, we call it G. G is also yam. G in my language, so in English, it's yam. So this is yam. This is G. So I'm going to show you guys how you could preserve your yam for future use, okay? Yes, in case you want to preserve it and you don't want to cook all of them today. So, this is uh, these are the methods you can preserve it. So, when you want to cook it, you can now go to fridge and bring it out and uh, cook. Okay? So, keep watching. So, first of all, you have to peel it. You have to peel the yam. You have to peel the back. Peel the back. This is how I I like peeling my yam this way. I don't normally cut my yam, the yam before peeling. So I, I peel it like this straight. Peel it straight, you can cut the yam in sections. In sections like this. You can cut it in section, section by section like this. Depends on the way you wanna you can cut it this way. If you wanna cut like me, I normally cut straight. 
that's my method but I, I'm, I will still show you guys other methods you can use to peel your yam uh -huh. so now you can peel the one by one it's still the same thing it depends on whichever that works for you yeah you peel it first I like peeling my yam first so if you want to fry the yam you can cut it this is the head the head is not normally sweet for frying so i put it i separate it Hit the red button to subscribe to the channel. Like and share the video. Make the video go viral. Keep watching. Then this one, I'm gonna cut it for porridge yam. I will be using it to cook porridge yam. So you use yam to cook many different things, you know. So the one that you will use for porridge jam, you will not cut it so big. Yeah. Slice it like into four this way. So that it will not dissolve so much in the pot so this big big lump i will use it to cook gym milk this ones are for gym milk gym milk so now i'm going to wash all of them and separate them put them in their different uh, ziplock as I'm going to use them in the future, not today. I'm not going to cook it today. This is the bag. After peeling, I have to throw away the bag in the trash. This is the back of the yam. I just peeled it. This is the back. So I have to throw this away. Trash it in the trash can. I have to first of all put it in a better bag. Hit the red button to subscribe to the channel. Like and share the video. Make the video go viral. Keep watching. We have to wash our yam. We have to wash our yam before saving. See? We have to wash it before saving it on the zip lock. We have to wash it before saving it in the, putting it in the zip lock. Then put it inside the fridge for future use.
watching and see how we are going to package our yam in the ziplock for future use. So this is our ziplock. So, watch how I'm going to package it in the ziplock. So, I will start with the ones for Jim Miriok. They got those ones. Jim Miriok. That is uh, yam pepper soup. They are big, big lump. See, see the way I cut them big, big. These are for. Hit the red button to subscribe to the channel. Like and share the video. Make the video go viral. Keep watching. So I'll use them to make a yam pepper soup. This ones. So I think that is all for that. This is for Jimmy Leo. Look at it. Jimmy Leo. Yam pepper soup. I will use this to prepare yam pepper soup. Set this aside. I have to select those for frying. The flat ones, those that I cut flat ones, these ones are for frying. See, I cut them so flat so that when you want to fry it, it's not going to take ages. It's not going to take so long before it will be done. So that is why I, fry, I cut it so tiny but flat. Select these ones, they are for frying. Look at them, see the sizes. These ones are for frying. I have to separate those. I'm gonna fry. Yeah, see, these ones are for frying for breakfast. For porridge yam, look at it. look at the sizes. I'll use this one for porridge yam to cook porridge yam. If you're a lover of porridge yam, put your comment in the comment section. Let, let us know how you make or how you prepare your porridge yam. Okay? Yes. Hit the red button to subscribe to the channel if you are still watching up till now and you are yet to subscribe to the channel. Now, uh, I'm going to package the one for pounded yam. Hit the red button to subscribe to the channel. Like and share the video. Yeah. Make the video go viral. I'm going to watch package this one for pounded yam. This one, or you, you can use it for pounded yam, or you can use it to eat white yam. Just boil it, use oil, and um, yeah, one day. That's a video of another day. I will boil it and show you guys how we also eat white yam and oil white yam and red oil so this one i will use this one for pounded yam yeah so i will be showing you guys when i will cook it and show you guys how to cook yam Pounded yam, okay. So keep 
watching guys yeah now so after putting it in the ziplock i have to write the, the are uses see for porridge yam for yam pepper soup for pounded yam see so after labeling it i have to now put them in the freezer depending on when i will use it to cook okay so let's go okay. Hit the red button to subscribe to the channel like and share the video make the video go viral keep watching peeling it so I'm going to wash it now then throw away the back hit the red button to subscribe to the channel like and share the video make the video go viral keep watching
thank you all for watching up till now like and share the video okay yes hit the red button if you are watching up to now and you are yet to subscribe yes so we are going to continue in the next video where we are going to prepare the yam okay yes so keep watching guys see you in the next video bye bye see you soon.